We go forth with power and prayer in the word. Peace is gonna be here. We ain't gotta worry about it. We gonna already set the stage for a peaceful rally under the power of God. Come on out. Today we're having a unity march with LAPD. This may be the only march that I've heard of in the country where we're marching with the police to support our, our community. Here we have a very close relationship with the community. The community reach out to us and they want to do something to show their togetherness with our station and we're going to march with the community here today. That shows the unity between the community and the police department. Today is a day about unity. Today is about sharing a hurt to our very uh, to our very nation, and I look forward to having a great day marching in unison. This is a, a way for this community to heal, to unite, and we're doing so with our local NAACP chapter, our state senator who's here, shoulder to shoulder, lock and step with our community-based organizations, with our law enforcement partners. Everybody take a knee. LAPD officers, everyone take a knee. We will march until victory has come. We will cry out. We will march. We will stay strong. Amen. Amen. I'm smiling under here. There is a problem in the world and we just want everyone to see it, how the black community sees it and to open their mind to for change and to know that things can get better and we want them to want things to get better along with us. We need each other to call out the um, injustices, not only here in this region, but throughout our country. And we're doing so alongside LAPD, which is fantastic. I love my police officers in the Harbor Division, but I also want to make sure that everybody is treated fairly and equally and I'm afraid that black people have not been. I'm hoping this will lead to a larger discussion and larger solutions that can be put into action. Our goal is to let the community know that we're working with the police department and we want fairness out of all of this. We want change like everyone wants it. There is change coming. And you young people, the young people, you guys can make the change because in our generation, I'm 60 years old, in our generation, we didn't do it. But you guys don't believe in the white, the, all this stuff. Everybody is one. That's what this generation believes in. The millenniums, more power to you, and I mean that too. Money! Money! Money!